I obtained Katie Williams resignation letter from a source close to her. She is leaving her role as trustee in District B, a position that paid $750 a month. In the letter addressed to the CCSD Board of Trustees president, she writes she believes the DA is wrong on the law and she has been and is a current resident of Nevada. Williams posted on X about her resignation. Take a look. She writes, quote, persecution often comes because the righteous cannot be beat fairly. And, quote, I only feel sorry for the children of Clark County School District that will now be left with a board of chaos that will not remain focused on kids. I had a chance to speak with District Attorney Steve Wolfson. He had filed a petition asking the court to vacate Williams seat. Channel 13 has been reporting on the controversy swirling around where Williams actually lived. Trustees are required to live in their district. Well, it's pretty simple. I mean, the law says that you must reside in the district you represent. Um, you have an obligation to your constituency to reside in the district. And we believe that she's violated that tenant. I also contacted Williams attorney Adam Levine, who says Williams will be making her own statement at a later time. Now you may be wondering what's next. After all, Williams represents a district with 55 schools and over 40,000 students. We spoke with CCEA executive director John Bellardita. He tells us CCSD will now be tasked to fill her seat. They'll be taking applications and the board of trustees will vote on the next trustee during an open meeting. The process can take two weeks or more. In Las Vegas, I'm Jay Wan Jung.